Welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West, the Burning Shores edition. So we're back in Fleet's End, and we're about to meet up with our good friend Seiker after that last mission. There she is around the corner. Oh yeah, by the way, do you guys like our new outfit here? We've got the uh, Quen Deadeye look going on, which I think is pretty cool. Pretty badass. The reason I decided to go for this armor was because uh, this one is legendary. And the one we had before, even though it looked really cool, was like only very good. And as you know, these things, like, um, ideally you go for the better of equipment. Great. Is everything okay? I gave my report to the Admiral. Apparently, some of the crew have called for me to be stripped of rank and cast out. Oh dear. I'm so sorry, Seika. That must be really hard to take. It doesn't matter. Where are we headed next? Well, um, we know where Laundra sent the data from his old come We're on the mainland, north of where we met. Should be able to fly there. Yeah, about that. Let's take my skiff this time instead. Not a fan of flying, huh? I'm a marine. I'll take the water over the skies any day. All right, I'll take your skiff. Should we get going? Uh, yeah, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Follow me. Oh, my word, guys. I've said it before, but, uh... You know, to, you can just keep saying it. Just the... Just look at this. This, ga this game is beautiful. Nice and easy. And, unlike flying, if you fall off, you don't die. Very good. What's interesting is, this game technically came out last year. I mean, yeah, this is the expansion. Us, along with everyone in it. Why do but, I mean, if you look at, like, the quality of the, the, the face I mean, I, I get capture what it's in this like. game, it's just... I feel as if an entire tribe's against you. I would have stormed out of there a long time ago. It wasn't always like this. I was a good Marine. A good sister. It felt like I belonged. That belonging is a kind of strength. One that keeps me going even in the roughest seas. When you have something like that, you can't cast it aside. I see. You know, your people don't know how lucky they are to have you. I don't know about that. I do. Yeah, Aloy does. She, of course, was uh, an outcast, basically from birth, because she was would one effectively say a virgin birth, the virgins, parthenogenesis? Well, it seems like the coordinates are leading us towards that horse. That thing gives me the creeps. On clear nights, we can see it from the camp looming over us. There you go, there's that horse over there in the horizon, in the distance. There! On the shore! More of our boats! Then we're on the right track. I'll take us in! Okay, let us check it out. Okay. So the stars in their eyes. Somewhere up the hill. After you. Let's go check out those coordinates. I'm just gonna save quickly. And let's go. And then, of course, look at this lava. Oh, how cool. I wonder if we'll, like... Like, we'll get hurt if we go in there, right? I probably shouldn't go in there. Yeah, let's, let's stay out. Let's stay away from the lava. Okay, up the hill we go. Let's see where this place takes us. See what's going on. Uh, one thing I should have. Oh uh, well, I was thinking Definitely of um. Seems like we're heading for the Metal Devil. Why would Landra send his data here? I'm not sure. It's not a place to bring a bunch of Quen to. I just hope it, we find them. It is odd, isn't it? My people were here, all right. Looks like they headed further up the hill. Coordinates lead that way too. 
Let's uh, let's go see. This way, I'm guessing. Oh, look at that Hollywood sign. Nice. Hollywood, a barrier. Laundra must have set it up. Doesn't look like there's a way past it. Ooh. There's some kind of device on the other side. I think I can scan it. Okay, right, let's save. And then let's go scan the entrance to the crystal maze. See what it is. My focus is this Aloy scanning it? Too? Device. Focus on this device, okay. Alright. Let's see what's on this thing. It looks like there's something further in. Some kind of compound. Laundra might be in there. You're missing people, too. I'm not seeing a way past the barrier. There. It's some kind of power generator. Hooked up to the arm of the Horus. Laundra's figured out how to get part of it working again. A metal devil can't actually wake up, can it? I'm not sure. But at least right now, it must be how Laundra's powering the barrier. So if we can find a way to shut down those generators, it should come down. It's worth a shot, at least. It looks like there are two of them nearby. Come on, let's get going. Okay, so shut down the generators, open the crystal maze. should be back down the hill. Uh, so wait, so where are they? One is... They're both back down the hill, aren't they? Okay, we can... One's there, and then one is back there. Alright, let us do it. Let's get to them. Oh, wait, wait, wait where's the... Oh, look at that pig. Oh, I wanted to kill it. I haven't actually done any hunting in this particular playthrough. But that is a uh, something of a necessity if you want to upgrade your uh, uh, some of your equipment, specifically some of your pouches and stuff. Whoa! Look at that! What? Wander went to a lot of trouble to power that shield. Oh, he do ugly okey. friends too. Ugh. So, uh, more we've got to get to that, Just and we've got to go through all this. Yeah. Okay, and we've got to get to that one as well. Okay, we can. How are we gonna do this? It's on to me. Here we go! There we go. Okay, I'm gonna try and be really sneaky if I can. Uh yeah, let's let's see. Can we climb up here? Come on, Aloy, come on. Come on, girl. I feel like we can do it. Come on. There we are. Okay. Just chill. Very chill. And here okay. we are. Let's see if we can shut this thing down. Some kind of power core. I can't hit the core on my own. Seika, I need you to shoot the core. Seika? Uh, where are you, love? Come on, where is she? Okay, there she is. Okay, come on. Let's go, Seika. Teamwork. Lining up a shot. One down. Boom. Now for the other generator. Okie dokie dokie. Now, how are we going to get to that other one? Um. Could we go across there? We go across there. We climb up there. 
that way. Or... Yeah, I think, I think that's the best. I think that is our best bet. Alright, um, Seika, can you glide? Because if not, you should probably learn to glide. And we go around this way. And we will traverse this rock face, do some bouldering. Come on, we can boulder here, right? Come on, we can do some bouldering, come on. Oh, don't tell me we can't do bouldering here. Red means no, right? Oh, God. Uh, come on. Oh, God, okay, we can't do it. Okay, this isn't going to be fun. Um, Alright, wait, 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 round there. Okay, I've got it. We glide over there. And then boulder along up here. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Oh, okay, maybe you just wait. Just chill. Oh, come on, it can't see us. It can't see us, right? Come on, go away. Just go away. Please. Okay. I think we are good. Uh, let's let this track. Alright, looks like it's going away. A lot of, uh, a lot of bushes here, aren't they? Okay, let's do our thing. Okay, again. Come on, Sega, come on. Oh, crud. We're not going to be able to do this, are we? No, we're not going to be able to do this. Okay, looks like we are throwing down. Um, let's do it. Oh, crud, two of them, come on. Come on. No, we need to get out of here. Will they see us here? That's my question. Chill. I don't think Seika activates the aggro. So, oh god, just... I mean, we'll still lay a little trap or so. We're gonna need to lay a lot of traps. Oh god, I don't know how we can do this. We're gonna have to throw it out, aren't we? Okay, come on, let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, so what's it? Fire and ice. Fire and ice is the thing with these guys. Uh, with my fire arrows, come on. Yikes! 
Thanks. Okay, this one's on his ass as well. Come on. Saker's down. But she was kind enough to uh, ow, give us a big helping hand. So let's make sure we don't squander her gift. Oh, no ammo. Okay, let's go with the fire one. Boom. Focus on the generators. Oh my days. Okay, gotta watch out for the sticky and the poison and everything and my days, my days. Alright, so yeah, you guys can see in this game you, you gotta be able to change plans on the fly. Clearly plan A didn't work, nor did plan C, D, E, or run away. Nor did tactical retreat. Okay. Nor did find a safe place from which to cheese him. And in the end, we kind of just had to stand our ground. So let that be a lesson for you the next time you're getting bullied by two giant mecha frogs. I like to think I'm here to help. Core's exposed. Okay, come on, Seiko, would you please? To shoot this thing, come on. Thank you. Right, let's get back to the bunker entrance. Barrier should be gone now. Yes. yes. I hope my people are in there. Let us get back there. And yes, indeed, we hope the people are in there. Now, I did see. Was it here? Yeah, you can search in the cars. And you get cargo crates. Nice. Yeah, for sure this game is all about uh, the resources. The story, of course, but also the resources. Oh boy! You know, the last time I saw my sister, I was relieved she was leaving for a scouting mission. I guess I wanted a break from her. I get it. Things aren't always easy with my sister, either. I thought you said you were an outcast. I only met her recently. It's a... It's a long story. Always full of surprises, huh? Wait, what the hell? I tried. Wait. Point is, I'm... I'm sure your sister will be glad to see you. I don't know. But it's is this seriously nowhere said. to climb here? Huh. I don't think this leads back to the entrance. Okay, this is the way we want to go. Let's go, let's get a move on, ladies. Hustle, hustle. Yeah, that was a pretty monster fight. And, you know, I, I don't know, I think, I think the lesson ought to be, you know, go into these things tactically, plan. Engage them as sieges instead of just hitting and hoping and hoping you can sneak by. It worked! Barrier's gone! Let's head in. Sweet. Let's get in there. Heaven's rest. Looks like this place still has some power. Generators must have just been for the shield. So we're into the crystal maze now. Oh, hello. Uh, Plague of Frogs. On the whole, I find Sobek's machines to be tiresome. Do we really need terraforming robots to resemble giant lizards? 
Uh, the megafauna metaphor is almost comically trite. It reminds me of Evelyn's Hollows, which in the end were little more than childish popcorn fo- fodder designed to separate tired parents from their surplus cash. That said, the big froggy things have manifested some useful behavior. Part of their function is to recycle technological components, and accordingly, they're attracted to some of my recently installed devices. Yet they don't seem to know how to process them, so they just kind of hang around and root through rubble for scrap. The upside, they discourage the locals from trifling with my toys. Who knows, with a little luck, maybe they'll discourage the redhead as well. Oh, I see. (laughs) Yeah, so, um... I mean, you guys have played the first Horizon, for sure, right? So you know that all of the dinosaurs, the pterosaurs, whatever they are, and uh, and the animals in this game, the, the, the giant mecha robot ones, they all actually serve some kind of function for Gaia. Or for the original intent of Gaia, which was terraforming the Earth, making it habitable again for hu- humanity. And another mural. And another mural. Hello. Why are they all just waiting? Find out. She's doing the barbarian. Seika, have you come to join us? Join you? Yeah, we have. It took a while, but we finally made it. <laughs> a barbarian, one of the chosen. Impossible. Zath would never allow this. Hmm. How did you get in without him? Well, Zeth sent us, actually. After. We helped him out of that, um, that ambush in the wilds. Right! You see, I was on my way here with him when machines attacked us. We tried to hold them off, but we were outnumbered. That's when Aloy here came to the rescue. I was exploring the region when I ran across them, so I just rushed in to help. (laughs) You should have seen her. One of the best machine hunters I've ever met. She saved Zeth's life. Oh, I was just doing what I could. Zeth had something important he needed to take care of after, so he said to go on without him. And that's when he told us how to lower the barrier and said we should head straight inside. Zeth really needed a barbarian to get him out of trouble. We all need a little supporting fire every now and then. Well, Zeth gave them the okay. And I am not risking one of his outbursts. Let the others inside know about our new arrivals, will you? Fine. But I'm not letting them into the Ascension Hall until they prove <laughs> they're devoted. Just like everyone else. And I'll be interested to hear Zeth's side of this when he returns. Oh, by all means. Man, these two are amazing at blagging. Good luck in there, Seika. May you both embrace his light. Okay. Uh, well, while we're here, can we talk to Aonia? Now, what is this ascension business? Uh, let's head on in. Oh, that was close. I can't believe my people are here willingly. And they answer to Zeth. Yeah, he sounds like a great guy. Let's get to this ascension hall before you have to meet him. So I'm guessing Zeth is not uh, Londra. Let's go. Let's see. Let's see Hold what's going on. Of Londra. Welcome, my chosen. You have wandered. You have suffered. But you are lost no more. For I have found you. And I offer you what you deserve. The Ascension. So be at ease. Forget what you think you know. And embrace this moment. A new world awaits. What does he want with the natives? Okay. Welcome, my chosen. Oh, that's a lot of Londra. Yikes. So he wants us to embrace his life. <laughs> Look at... Literally. Oh I man. He uh, likes himself, doesn't he? I'll try. Okay, let's see what's going on here. I'd like you to meet some old friends of mine. 
See, we were at the best party in town, celebrating our big win. And while everyone's attention was on me, my ex-business partner, well, he barges in, and he's jealous of our success, and he throws a drink in my face, but not a drop hit me, because my bodyguard, Jack, he tackled him to the floor, and the others, Riley and Nolan and Parker, well, they made sure he was kicked out. But it was my Evelyn who encouraged everyone to just laugh it off. I adored them. Their dedication to me meant everything more than any award. And it ended up being the best night of my life. I guess Laundra's used to people worshipping him. Gross. Hmm. So, like, what, what is this guy up to? There's another point of reference up here, it seems. Let's see. Will be truly wonderful. Ah, you must be the ones Brennick mentioned. Two more souls chosen to leave our thankless old life behind. Yes, that is us. It's Kiral, right? You were stationed on the Spark? In my former life, yes. Just one more Marine bound to a hopeless expedition. Ugh. Enough of that. Hmm? As Walter says, we must forget the past. Our suffering led us here, after all. And now... The Ascension is almost upon us. This place is such a wonder, isn't it? I've... never seen anything like it. Oh. But it is still nothing compared to what's in the Ascension Hall. You've been inside? Indeed. I proved my devotion not long before you joined us. Now I wait to be taken to what lies ahead. One step closer to the Ascension. Um, what lies ahead? You mentioned you're waiting for what lies ahead, and we're still getting up to speed, but... I thought the Ascension Hall was where we needed to go. You're not the first to fail to grasp Walter's plan for us. <laughs> now that I've seen what's in the hall, my rank is secure. But there is something more that he's offering us. I just know it. It has to be why the devoted are escorted to another place. And as soon as Zeth returns, he'll take me there. I'm ready. Do you have any idea where this place is, exactly? Somewhere that brings us closer to Walter. To his embrace. Hmm. Uh, the Ascension Hall? Inside the Ascension Hall. Is it as special as we think it is? I shouldn't say. I wouldn't want to deny you the same experience I had. Come on, Kural. Just a hint. We're dying to know what's inside. I'll tell you this. It's... breathtaking. Like the moment Walter first appeared before our boat. But better. Prove your devotion, and you'll see. Hmm, okay, well, how do we prove our devotion, I wonder? Well, thanks for talking with us, Kiral. We should get back to learning about Walter. Yes, of course. Good luck with your studies. I hope to see you at the Ascension. Damn, these guys really lapped up the Kool-Aid, haven't they? Oh, good. This guy again. Okay, that's where we need to go. Uh, I just want to check out this reference point over here. Is there another one over there? I wonder. Let, let's see. Oh, we have to actually sit with him. Let's listen to Laundra. I'd like to tell you a story. Once, I had a home on this world with the most beautiful view of the city. Me and my wife, we used to love to sit and watch the city lights twinkle in the evening haze. It's our moment of serenity. But then, 
the time of ashes came. And while the heavens offered an escape, only I survived and grasped the secrets of immortality. Evelyn, everyone I ever cherished, they were gone. And I was alone. Which is why I am so glad to have met you. Soon, you and I shall spend eternity on a new world. Every sunset. Together. Hmm. So, did his Evelyn go with him? To the uh, to this new world, or did she die in the time of ashes along with like most of humanity? That is my question. But anyhow, let's see if we can get through to the ascension hall. Well, hey, Brennick. It is an do-gooder and the barbarian. It all makes sense now. The time of ashes, the floods in the Great Delta. We've been trapped in a cycle of destruction, but soon we'll have a new world. That's quite a promise. And now that you've proved your devotion, you're ready for what comes next. Zeth will lead you there as soon as he returns. Not so fast. Your good deed in the wilds may have gotten you this far. But you'll get no special treatment here. Walter himself granted me the privilege of guarding the Ascension Hall. So until you complete your review and learn the words of attainment, this door remains shut. No exceptions. Okay, okay. We will be back later then. Okay, what are the words of attainment? It sounds like we're supposed to pass some kind of laundry devotion test. But who knows how long we have before the Zeth guy gets back. There's gotta be a faster way to learn whatever the words of attainment are. Let's take a look around. Don't think the words were in those Laundra holograms we watched. They might help with talking to the others. Maybe we could convince them to give us a hand. She acts like a super Maybe these guys who just came out of there? Or Tosu. I'll get us a drink. In the meantime, remember what Walter said about embracing the future. Seems like you don't really share your friend's excitement about all this. I should be more excited, shouldn't I? It's okay to question things. Lon was thrilled when we got into the Ascension Hall. He can't wait to see where we'll be taken next, but I'm worried that all this is too good to be true. So why don't you just leave? I can't abandon him. We've been through everything together. Our, our missions, the Typhoon, the Shiprock, and soon, the Ascension, I guess. Uh, tell Seems us about like your doubts, most buddy. Of the clan are more than happy to follow Londra. So why not you? At first, I wanted to believe. I mean, everything he told us felt like it filled an emptiness, like maybe I'd finally found somewhere to belong. But then I remembered how the boards back home would tell us to follow the virtues of the legacy, to be good and honest. And then they dragged my father away for speaking out against an imperial decree. I'm not sure it's any different here. Walter might be a living ancestor, but with a cudgel like Zeth to do his bidding, his kindness is just as conditional as the Empire's. Interesting. So, as much as the Quinn don't necessarily like the whole Empire situation back home, they... I mean, this guy certainly has the perspicacity to, to notice where it's being set up here. That's, uh, that's what you need. One of them's woken up, at least. How did Dion end yes. up here? Both anyone knows, you went out into the wilds and vanished. How did you end up here? Lon and I were part of a scouting mission to the mainland, but things went bad fast. We were lost and starving, 
Our boat was wrecked, and then Walter found our camp. A living ancestor, emerging from the wilds to tell us we'd been chosen, that we were safe. It was easy to embrace. Everyone here has a similar story. Why didn't anyone send word to us? Not everyone is chosen. Walter says we must leave our old lives behind if we're going to ascend. Nobody questioned it. But I should have. Uh, what's the next location? You said Lon can't wait to see where you're headed next. Do you know what you'll find there? I imagine it'll be another kind of test, like here. Once you've been in the Ascension Hall, you're taken there by Zeth. He and his troops are the only ones who ever come back. Everyone keeps mentioning him. I get the feeling he's not really a friendly guy. <laughs> as friendly as a fireclaw. But it's not just him. The soldiers that follow him are like that too. I guess they know they can do as they like, now that they don't answer to the Admiral or compliance. So anyway, uh, right. about attainment. Don't be skeptical of all this. Wander is up to something. We need to get into the Ascension Hall to figure out what. And to do that, we need the words of attainment. I don't want to stir up any trouble. When Zeth comes back, he'll figure out that I told you. Does it have something to do with one of those laundry displays? This is important, Otosu. A lot of lives are at stake. It's related to what Walter said he valued most about his friends. Uh, they gave him attention, they adored him. They adored him. I guess he thought he was adored by them? No, that's not it at all. This was a bad idea. Oh, crud. I shouldn't be talking to you. Hey, it'll be okay. I promise. I'm sorry, I can't. Now please, just leave me alone. Oh, crud. Could have gone better. Don't think we'll be able to convince him to help us again. Maybe we should study up on Lanja before we talk to anyone else. I'm sure that's what it said, wasn't it? Uh, okay, we're being led to speak to her. Is that sick? Did you need something else? Uh, attainment, yeah. Look, Kiral, we need your help. You said that the Ascension is almost here. Seika and I are trying to prove our devotion as fast as we can. But we're running out of time. We need to get into the Ascension Hall. But, but the only way to learn the words of attainment is to pass your devotion review. Unless you help us out. We're a lot like you. We've suffered so much until now. Storms, shipwrecks, hunter killer machines. We don't want to go back to that. Well, we should all embrace his life. Perhaps even with a helping hand. Okay. Yeah? It's kind of what Walter said when he sat with us and told us his story about where eternity lies. Uh, a new world. It's not a new world, right? As part of the Ascension? Exactly. You understand him so well. But... I don't know. I... I really shouldn't be breaking protocol. Please, Karal. We don't want to live in a world without Walter. <laughs> okay, These two. Only through devotion may I embrace his light. I was right Only in devotion, right? May I ascend to a new world. Okay. Thanks. We owe you one. I'm glad to have helped. May you embrace his light. Thank you, Kirill. Well, we got our words of attainment. Renick should let us into the Ascension Hall now. All right, let's, let's see if this ahead. works. I already told you. No one's getting past me without the words of attainment. Oh, we know the words. Seika. Oh, no. You should have the honor, Aloy. Only through devotion 
May I embrace his light only through him. May I ascend to a new world. No one's ever passed their devotion review so quickly. <laughs> well, we did. So will you get out of the way now? Oh, he's still suspicious. But we did it. I don't know how much more of Londra I can take. Yeah, let's see what he's really up to. Let's. And we will find out next time, guys. That's all for now. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.